top five animals on steroids. Bodybuilding competitions for women and men do not surprise anyone. Animals' jockstrap is quite another thing. The owners are pumping their pets with steroids to amaze the imagination of the public and to cash in on it. We are presenting the top five animals mutilated by steroids. Number five, kangaroo. This kangaroo lives with very developed muscles in a reserve near the town of Albany. The official version for the press is a genotype mutation of kangaroos, and therefore the muscle mass grows and there is almost no fat. However, many sources claim that the animal is feeding by chemistry. Only this explains its unrealistic proportions. In addition, many curious people come to see this miracle of pharmaceuticals, which allows earning good money on the animal. What will happen to the health of the unfortunate animal? Apparently, nobody cares. 4. Cows Belgian blue cows who have been selected by interbreeding gave rise to cramming by steroids of ordinary representatives of cloven-hoofed animals. A fairly clever method. In fact, when there are already quite healthy cows, jockstraps of natural origin, it is possible to create a mutant cow with the help of pharmaceuticals. No one will notice the change. Cow monsters look like real bodybuilders. Their muscle mass is huge and relief. The meat of those cows is supplied in large quantities for sale and, apparently, it does not matter that the beef on steroids is unsuitable for food. 3. Ferrets it's hard to believe, but the ferrets were grown illegally in the territory of Argentina. They were pricked with steroids since their birth. The animals got into anabolic steroids and have grown to such an extent that they have become like medium-sized dogs. They were also specially combed so that they look very fluffy and externally resemble toy poodles. The truth came to light when one American acquired two ferrets, grown on steroids, for a high enough price for thoroughbred dogs. The man did not know that he had been deceived until a visit to the vet with the ferrets. Imagine his surprise when the dogs got the dreaded diagnosis that they are not poodles at all, but ferrets, jockstraps. 2. Horses Horses are the first victims of pharmaceutical tools. After all, horse riding has long been well developed. Horses were the first who started to enter the doping before jumps. This ugly phenomenon has already threatened to bring great trouble to horse breeding. Most racehorses are on steroids today. Great sport requires a lot of sacrifices, but whether it can be an excuse? Particularly horrifying that some horses are so crammed with chemistry that they become similar to bodybuilders on the day of competition. This is done exclusively for the show and the possibility to cash in on such a demonstration of the poor animal. Number 1. Dogs Animal rights defenders have been trying to ban the bloody and brutal dogfighting, but still in vain. All working pit bulls, the most popular breed in the ring, are fed with pharmaceuticals like oxandrolone, testosterone, and its derivatives. This is a huge burden on the preparation before the dogs fight, but intensive training reaches up to 8 hours a day. Regardless of good animal genetics, they would not have been able to withstand such a rhythm without pharmaceutical remedies. The health of fighting dogs is poor, and usually the dog, which is dependent on the pharmaceuticals, has a short life. The worst thing is that the dogs that are crammed with anabolics are used in breeding, which is why the number of cold dogs is growing. The effects of steroids are especially sad for some ring dogs. Apparently, they begin to look like pumped bodybuilders, and they die very quickly. Love your brethren. Put likes and subscribe to the channel if you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.